Digital Romance TV. Fabulous friends of Digital Romance TV, Alana Pratt here, your intimacy expert. Love your question, says Alana. I am insane about my buddy's ex-girlfriend. They broke up about a year ago and he's dating someone else now. What should I do? Well, I would say the coast is clear. It's been a year. And what did you say? He's dating someone else? Dude, the coast is super clear. What's the hesitation? Uh, are you afraid to ruin your relationship with your buddy? Uh, is it like an unspoken guy rule that you don't do that? Um, are you afraid that if it goes really well, you'll feel weird about that with your buddy? Like, where's the concern? Get clear about that. Then let go of whatever uh, conclusions you've come to, whatever fears are there, whatever doubts are there. Just get all the way down to like, what's the highest good of this situation? Would be that he's happy with his new girlfriend, you're happy with his ex-girlfriend, everybody's happy. That's what's possible here. So the next thing I think would be to have a conversation with your buddy. And just to, I mean, he might like not even give a shit. You're the only one that might be like la, 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 in here, right? Um, but if a conversation needs to happen for you to feel an integrity and to feel free for the highest good to come, no matter what the outcome is going to be, I think that feels good. Uh, I think that's where, where, where you need to go. If it's uh, something deeper and you're just sort of making excuses, it's really not about your friend or about the ex. It's just in general, you have, you're timid or hesitant about going for what you want in life, be it a woman, a job, anything. If that's like a pattern, then let's have a look at that and let's use this as, as a spiritual training for you to stand in what's true for you no matter what, no matter what other people think or say, and live your, live your life, dude, live your life. Um, either way, it's a great opportunity, a great possibility here that's going on. And I'm glad that you're insane about somebody, that you're really that alive. Um, wonderful, enjoy the process. And um, one last little um, nuance there, Whenever somebody's insane about somebody, that's a lot of power or a lot of energy. And so let's make sure we get grounded and centered before we go at a woman with an insane amount of attraction because you could end up pushing her away. Let's just do our work so that you're, you're partly an invitation as well as a, a man who claims somebody. You're really in your, your balance and your power. All right? You sound awesome. So I really look forward to hearing from you how this goes. And if you'd like a partner in this, in this journey, and you would like to feel absolutely free in your choice, free of hesitancy, free of doubt, just able to, to be authentically you and enjoy the process of the unknown uh, of life, then I would love to, to get to know you and see if you're a fit for me to invite you to work with me. You can apply for a complimentary strategy session at alanapratt.com forward slash connect. Uh, you sound awesome and I want the highest good to come for you and your friend and everybody, everybody on the list. All right. Thank you. All my love. If you're like most guys, you're sick and tired of being rejected by women, put in the friend zone and basically ignored by girls who go for bad boys and jerks. That's why I want you to go to digitalromance.tv forward slash girl code right now. At that URL, you'll discover the simple three-step cheat code into any girl's mind, heart, or panties. Getting good with women really is as simple as these three things. Go to digitalromance.tv forward slash girl code now.